What's up guys, this is Roman Fritz here with Frank McGrath. We just trained back at the Lift Factory in Las Vegas, Olympia Weekend 2017. Pretty good gym here in Las Vegas. It's one of the best gyms I've probably been at about in, uh, in here in Vegas for sure. Yeah. So thanks for having us. And um, we started out the workout with uh, old school, like Arnold did it, chin-ups. We just counted reps. So we had to do 50 reps in total. Since I was a little kid, okay, I always sucked at chins. I never could, you know, climb up the ropes yeah. in gym yeah. class. I never could do the flips, you know, the, on the bar yeah, yeah, and yeah. all that shit. Never, not even once, okay? So, chin ups, I suck at them. So, I band them, take a little weight off my body, and um, make it. It's not making it easier, it's making it uh, work. Just an assistance. Yeah. Well, you know, I think. Because I didn't, I did it without the band, and I'm pretty good at chimps. But the thing I think is that when you did it with the band, you can get that more of a contraction. I think because like when I go That's up, right. I couldn't go like I couldn't yeah. squeeze, you can't right? hold it, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm working up there, myself up there. Probably I'll get a, uh, a weaker band soon. Okay, so next on the list, we did the superset and it was machine pullovers and underhand grip pulldowns. Machine pullovers first because the pullover is the only back exercise that does not involve any arm, any bicep. So it's like doing a leg extension before squats. You just pre-exhaust the target muscle and then you get, a, you can't use as, as much weight of course, but you get a lot more lat out of the pull down. Let me ask you a question. So it's very rare you find a, a good, well actually a lot of gyms don't have a pullover machine. Mm -hmm. And a lot of gyms that do have them, they're not very good. This was a good one, actually. What would you do if you didn't have that machine? Would you do pullovers with a dumbbell? I would do pullovers with a dumbbell or a rather than with the band? rope. Oh, rope? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because on the lat pulldown, you're definitely getting the contraction yeah, yeah. on the pulldown. Yeah. yeah. But you're not getting a good stretch back yeah, here. Yeah, I got you. Yeah, yeah. And so, the thing is, I think you showed me too not to go back too far because I felt like I was, sometimes I used to always go back so far and it would just hurt your shoulders. Yeah, exactly. You have yeah. to get, like find the sweet spot. Yeah, it's not always about going full range of motion. It's about don't go no, don't go as far as the machine will let you go. Sometimes. Exactly. It's about going optimal range of motion. Yeah, I got you. Got yeah. you. So, number three and four, we did two hammer strength movements. But since we were training together, we shared two hammer strength machines. Did them one arm, because I like one arm hammer strength Isolation. better than both. Yeah. Yeah, unilateral, yeah. yeah. And we did um, three sets on each machine and just basically going straight sets. Straight sets, no resting. Right arm, left arm, right arm, left arm, right arm, left arm. Three sets on each, and then we switch machines. So we did 
didn't go very heavy. Yeah. But by the time you get to that third set, oh, I mean, man, you're on fire. Yeah. It's heavy then. Yeah. yeah. The, the the fatigue is accumulates. Right. right. I tell you know people I don't. There's a time I do train really heavy, and there's times that I like the intensity more. Yeah. You know? So I think this this workout was more of an intense workout than a you know a exactly. record breaking workout. You know what I mean? Especially when you're traveling, and you're at the foreign gym. You did, and it's freaking hot outside. You don't get the the water you normally get and the food you normally get. Rest you're a little bit more brittle, and more I don't want to yeah. sure, You yeah. don't want to tear a lat yeah. just because you, you feel good on the video. Yeah. yeah, yeah, gotcha. So, and then we finished off back with shrugs, just regular, basic, heavy dumbbell shrugs. Five sets there. And then we finished off with a superset for rear delts, you know, get, give, the, give the rear delts the pop. And I like the, you can use a machine for that, you can use dumbbells, but this cable apparatus was right next to us. It's an old school one. Yeah, a global gym. Yeah, yeah. yeah. With the silver um, weight stack. So we did um, superset it, the, the high pulley rear delts and the low pulley rear delts for five, five supersets, and that was it. If you haven't been here this year, you might want to think about coming next year because every year you're not here, you're missing something, especially at the Animal Booth. Thanks for watching. Follow the Animal Pack YouTube channel, the Animal Pack Instagram, and um, that was Roman Fritz for Frank McGrath from Las Vegas, Nevada, Olympia Weekend 2017. Goodbye.